everyone happy Thursday well it looks like I've been tagged in quite a few tags and video responses that I've been trying to do but I just never think of it when the camera goes on so I figured I would get at least part of them done this is a 50 question tag that I've dropped down to 12 only because of time I haven't read through them I guess I should have uh, that would have been smart um, but if you'd like to do them, you're more than welcome to answer them either down below or make a video response. And upon that, you can attach it to this video. I'm going to pre-approve everybody so that way um, I don't have to sit there and approve videos to be posted. So, uh, like I said, I have not read through any of this, so uh, I'm a little bit nervous. I guess I should have. Number one question is, what did you want to be when you were little? Um, a baker. I wanted to be a baker, a chef, a cook, some sort of to do with food because I absolutely love when I was about three or four years old my nanny would put things together and she was teaching us and we would learn how to do like play-doh and breads and pies and anything to do with anything and we were putting them together just to see what different flavors melted with different flavors if that makes any sense anyways um my favorite still to this day is strawberries and blue cheese dressing so I know that's kind of weird, but I am caught with more salads with strawberries and blue cheese dressing than anything. And if I don't hand make the blue cheese dressing, then it would have to be lighthouse blue cheese dressing that's chunky. Plain and simple. Bar, bar none, the best salad dressing ever. Um, what's your best childhood memory? I remember when I was little, my Uncle Joe um, gave me a dollar. And I went into the store, and I, he, he gave me a dollar for candy, and I came out with shelled peanuts. And he was so angry at me. Not the fact that I didn't get candy, it was the fact that I got peanuts, and I got shelled peanuts. And I got the lecture to beat all lectures, basically saying um, that I put somebody's job at risk, and I need to think of other people when I purchase things. And basically, some guy named Bill, or Bob, or Stephanie, or Julie, or Jose, or whatever, basically is out there without a job because I bought shelled peanuts and that was their one job in life is to shell those peanuts. And so from then on, I've always thought of everything I've purchased, I need to do job security for everything. And so I've actually stopped buying few things just to keep job security for USA or for a certain person or many people um, still going. If that makes any sense, that really probably didn't because it didn't make sense in my head. Are you a cat or a dog person? Yes, I'm both. I love animals, any type of animals. I kind of stay away from the spiders and snakes and stuff, but uh, otherwise, yes, I do have an African Grey, which has been talking all morning and have has really quieted down since I turned on the camera, which is awesome. Um, are you married? Um, yes, yes, I'm married. Um, always wear seat belts. No, I, I forget a lot. I forget to wear seat belts quite a bit. And so, um, there's that. And plus I've always thought of if I'm going to die in a car accident, um, it's my time. So I really do try to wear my seat belts, but a lot of times I do actually forget. Have I ever been into a car accident? Yes, I was in a massive car accident that ended up in the hospital for several weeks. And yes, I was wearing my seatbelt at that point. Um, any pet peeves? Stupidity. Stupid people bug the right out of me. Oh my God, it just, it, it kills me some of the questions that they ask and you just go, really? Really? Um, I, half the time I have to walk away. Favorite pizza toppings? Uh, I'm, I'm an everything person. I love everything, but if I wanted to sit down and go, okay, this is what I'm going to have for dinner tonight if it's going to be homemade, I would like to um, home make some sauce with some basil and some salt and pepper and um, peeled tomatoes and squish them in and heat them up to probably 360 degrees and let them boil for about an hour and I would probably put that on the pizza crust with some homemade mozzarella which I do make my own homemade mozzarella and some basil. Wow that was more technical than I thought I would sorry. Favorite flower? Stargazer Lily. I think they're just absolutely amazing. Amazing. And my second one is, I seen it the other day, uh, no, I 
I seen it yesterday when I was going to Lowe's. I seen an orange poppy that was just breathtaking. Favorite ice cream. Uh, I don't eat that much ice cream because when I do, it kind of makes me feel like I have to clear my throat a lot, so I kind of stay away from that. Um, but my very absolute favorite ice cream in the whole wide world was root beer float, and I had it one time, and that's the only time I could find it, and it just tasted like you were drinking a root beer float. It was it had the bubbles and the cream and just it was amazing. And uh yeah, that was incredible. Also, um strawberry ice cream from the ice cream factory in California in San Francisco Bay Area. Freaking phenomenal. I mean they make the ice cream right then and there and you say, I want strawberries, and they'll throw cut up strawberries into the blender, and you say, I want chocolate chips, and they'll put chocolate chunks in there, and they make it seriously right in front of you. It was incredible. Favorite fast food restaurant? Um, I don't remember. Hi, hi and Mike's. No. I love the Noodle Company. That's probably my second favorite fast food restaurant. My first is I seriously, I cannot even remember the name of it. It's a re it's a Hawaiian restaurant. It came over. Um, it's not High and Mike's. It's not Hilo's. It's not uh, Mokai's. It's I will I will put it somewhere on this video. I just don't remember the name of it right now. It's that much of my favorite. How many times did you fail your driver's license test? None. Um, I actually had been driving since I was about 12 years old and I just got my driver's license when I was 19 so um, yeah and I was driving all the time in fact I owned a car before I had my driver's license and I drove it every day anyways guys uh, this is the last of the questions 12 question if you would like to do it you're more than welcome to please answer them down below or do a video response I'd really appreciate it and attach it to this video anyways uh, I need to get to work. It's already 10 after 2. I'm going to quickly upload this and bolt out the door. I will see you the day after tomorrow's yesterday. Bye.